Talk about recycling. Turning an old jail into a holiday workshop. That is recycling. Stacey Engerbretson shows us what the holiday season looks like for the Oshkosh Police Department in tonight's NBC 26 Cares. Oshkosh police say when they're out on patrol, they encounter a lot of people who are struggling. So this holiday season, they're trying to make sure everyone has a Merry Christmas. On the second floor of the Public Safety Building, Officer Kate Mann has transformed the old jail into Santa's workshop. This is the area that I keep all of the stuffed animals in. Empty jail cells now filled with donations. It's, it's just amazing. I mean, we couldn't do what we do without the generosity of the community. PetSmart donated a thousand stuffed animals. A group of women from Lakefront Manor secured a grant to make handmade hats, scarves, and fleece blankets. And his church donated 120 blessing bags. In these bags are various items, including hygiene, hats, scarves, mittens, bottles of water. The department's command and community outreach vehicle also serves as Santa's sleigh during the holidays. On this day, Police Chief Dean Smith and Officer Mann visit the outlet mall. Thank you. To pick up donated clothing. Old Navy is adopting three families in need this year. I hope they feel happy. I do feel that with everything they receive, that they know that people care for them. The dress barn. That is awesome. Also glad to give to a family that's fallen on tough times. I think a lot of us have been in situations, you know, everybody's got a story. So just kind of not judging and, you know, just doing what we can to help them. Thank you. Yeah. Officer Mann and Chief Smith load up the presents. Santa slaves get full. <laughs> to make more special deliveries. Police have already given gifts to 11 refugee families living in Oshkosh, to young patients in two hospitals, and to local seniors. I mean, a lot of them started crying. They said they don't have family anymore. They weren't expecting any gifts this Christmas, and that it meant a lot to them. The homeless, at-risk youth, and domestic violence survivors will also have something under the tree. Police building even stronger relationships with the community they serve making sure no one is forgotten this Christmas. You know, and it's not a lot that we're giving them, but it, it's something to say, hey, you are remembered, you are valued, and we want you to have a great holiday. If you'd like to donate anything from toys to toiletries, you can drop it off right at the Oshkosh Police Department. All they ask is that the items are brand new. Stacy Engebretson, NBC 26. And the Oshkosh Police Department does want to say a thank you to everyone who donated this past year.